My dear brothers and sisters, here we are again. Ramadan is coming. And I'm sure last year in the same position with the same thoughts, here we are again, Ramadan is coming. This Ramadan, I'll do it. This Ramadan, I'm going to change. It's going to be this one. And yet here we are again today, listening to this and saying, my God, was I not just thinking the same thing last year? Yet, did I really change? Not so much. And a lot of us feel sad. We feel sometimes depressed. Why am I not changing? Why am I not able to finally make that one year where I'm just changing forever? Why? I keep hearing the lectures. The one on the indications of acceptance of Ramadan is that you change after Ramadan. Yet I didn't change. Or I changed for one month, two months. And I go back to where I was. Why? Why can I not finally change once and forever? For good, I want to change. I'm tired of myself. I'm tired of how I feel. I'm tired to always just drag myself and just make the bare minimum. And I'm tired. I want, I want to be saved. I want to be better. I want to be a good Muslim. But here I am again, waiting, counting the days to Ramadan and afraid that Ramadan is going to go. I'm going to feel very good. I know, inshallah, Ya Rabb that I'm going to do well in Ramadan. I'm going to fast. I'm going to feel good. My iman is going to be high. Yet, I'm going to be scared as soon as I reach the last 10 days and towards the last 10 days that that's it. You know what I mean? I'm going to lose it. What am I going to do? Like, I'm going to be done. Again, I'm going to go back to the same position that I was before, wishing for another Ramadan and just wishing that, inshallah, I change. But I can't change. Why should I feel bad? What should I do? I'm depressed. I am depressed. I'm depressed because of my sins. The darkness of my sins is overtaking me. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm very, very tired. I'm losing hope. I'm losing hope. What should I do? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us in Surah Az-Zumar, verse 53. لا تقنتوا من رحمة الله إن الله يغفر الذنوب جميع إنه هو الغفور الرحيم Say all my servants who have transgressed against themselves by sinning do not despair of the mercy of Allah Do not despair of the mercy of Allah Indeed Allah forgives all sins Indeed it is He who is the forgiving the merciful I'm here to tell you don't lose hope I don't know how many Ramadans you've been in the same position, losing hope. All I'm telling you that never lose hope. Allah is telling you that He will forgive. لا تقنتوا من رحمة الله. Don't lose hope. So yes, you are in this position again, and you might be in this position next year and the year after. And how many Ramadans Allah Subhanahu wa Taala will give you? Inshallah, till the rest of our lives we experience Ramadan. But we will remember. من صام رمضان إيمانا واحتسابا غفر له ما تقدم من ذنبه Whoever fasts Ramadan with firm faith and conviction Allah will forgive their sins The same thing Whoever fasts, whoever prays Ramadan Allah will forgive their sins All you have to do is have faith and firm conviction Just believe Just live today You are here today Ramadan is in front of you What past cannot be changed what happens or comes you don't know you have no control over today you're welcoming ramadan today with an open heart remembering that you don't lose hope in allah every day is hope every minute is hope every second is hope islam is hope this is how we live take it one day at a time don't let the shaitan makes you lose hope. Have hope. Ya ibadi, oh my servant, my slave, who has transgressed against him or herself. La taqnatu mi rahmatillah. Do not despair of Allah's mercy. Alhamdulillah. Welcome Ramadan. Welcome. I will not despair of the mercy of Allah. I will do it as if the first time, inshallah. Inshallah. إن شاء الله بارك الله فيكم وجزاكم الله خير والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته